Hey everyone, welcome back to the NASCAR Heat 3 Career Mode. Let's play, ladies and gentlemen. This is part number 49 of the Career Mode. And I'm about to do the next Xfinity Series race at Darlington. And this race is important because uh, not only winning at Darlington is important, get 115 grand out of it, but this last race, I this race I need to win if I'm going to get a bonus 124 grand, basically 125 grand to have three wins in the inceptive contract, but I only have one more race, and that is this race at Darlington. So this race is important for me to win uh, because if I win this race and I get that inceptive contract bonus, I'm going to get a lot of money out of this race, uh, which would be awesome. Uh, let me go back and show you guys crew most things just to remind you what they are like. And there they are on the screen right now. Also, after this Darlington race, I do got a hot seat race in the Cup Series. So we'll see how that goes as well. But anyways, let me get on the Darlington. Let me get on the qualifying and see where I'll start. Coming off turn number four, the complete qualifying here at Darlington Raceway. Let's see what it's going to be. 11th, not bad. 30-62. Um, yeah, that's really not bad at all. Uh, hopefully, it could do better in the race. And... Uh, Christopher Bell gets the ball. Oh, I like how Brandon Jones starts right in front of me. That's great. Okay, so anyways, Christopher Bell starts in the pole. I start 11th. Let's just get around Brandon Jones right away. Let's get up to the front as soon as possible as well. Green flag is in the air. We're underway here in Darlington. Sorry, Austin Syndrome. I'm trying to use you as a pick. Okay, we're fine. Oh, my God. We're still... Oh my goodness! Wow, we're still leaning on each other, me and Elliot Sadler. Only 10 laps here, so I do want to get up to the front as quickly as possible. I'm trying to get by John Hernimacek now, which I do. Nice move. I'm already up to fifth. I feel like I got a fast car that could win this race. Oh, yeah, this is where I'm going to gain on them. It's going into the corner, but not if I hit the wall, obviously. Oh, I did again there. Jesus. I know I'm earning my... It's Darlington, you know. You got to earn your Darlington stripe, but it's not hit it too much. Austin Sindra got around me because of it. Oh, shoot. Justin Allgaier's lean, too. He can pull away, too. And that is somebody I don't need to pull away. Oh my god, I am being aggressive right now. I mean, I have to. I want to get this win. Oh, come on, Cindric. I needed that bottom lane. Or I could just send in... Oh no, what? Come on. Game. I barely touched him. Can we not get sideways when I barely touch somebody? If I slammed into him, that'd be one thing. Damn, that could have been a pass for third. Oh my god, I was in better I was in good shape right there until that happened. Alright, I gotta get going. Christopher Bell is actually falling back. I know I'm faster in these than these guys, especially going into the corner. But with them too wide and stuff, it's impossible to go three wide. Alright, I'm up to fifth. Let's catch these guys ahead of me. Doesn't look like Justin Allgaier is really pulling away, which is really good. I don't need any of the leaders to pull away because that would suck once I get up to second. I can't catch the leader because he's fast. Just like what happened with me and Justin Allgaier at uh, Mid-Ohio. Oh, I'm in the back of Sindrick. Sindrick's fast too. I mean, what, he started ninth? Oh my goodness, going for third. Got five laps to go. Oh my goodness! I am being so aggressive. I have to be. I want that extra 125 grand. It could make a difference, guys. Any money can make a difference. Oh my god, look at this move. I'm oh, come on. Don't get sideways. It almost got sideways there again. <gasps> oh wow, I didn't think I was going to get up in the Justin Allgaier there. But look at that. I'm up to second. Four laps to go. Alright, Justin. Why are you pulling away all of a sudden? Please don't do that. Oh, man. Here I come. 
My goodness, I'm all over the place. Sideways. It's been a good, fun race. Oh, no, don't hit the... Oh, 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 oh. oh my God, that was all me. That one was definitely my fault. I cut the... I turned too early. I hit that apron and got me sideways. I could have maybe still been side by side without guy or had that not happened but three laps to go man i tell you what austin centric is fast too he i have to keep an eye out on him this is some amazing racing oh yeah side by side here we go come on i'm not gonna clear him here oh my god i don't mean to him in the door two to go uh, all right, don't come down. Oh, man. He was coming down a little bit. Oh, my God. Please let me get around just... Oh, Geyer. We're still side by side. I can beat him right now. This going into this corner, I'm going to beat him. There we go. Now slide job in front of him. There we go. All right, to the lead, guys. I need to get this win if I'm going to complete this and set the contract with three wins. Here we go. Final lap here at Darlington. Also trying to get my eighth win of the season. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm pulling away. They're side by side behind me, which is good for me. Down the back straightway for the final time. All right. Coming off turn number four, guys. Looks like I made a statement. And I'm going to get the win here at Darlington. And I'm also going to complete the incentive contract with three wins. Holy crap, this race was not easy to win, to be honest with you. That was... I was being aggressive. I was sideways all over the place. That was a fun race. I was being aggressive. Doing these burnouts. So, yeah, I got my eighth win of the season. And there goes the engine now. Oh, man. I'm going to get some big money out of this race. Yeah, 114 grand winning the race. Team payout, 27. Merch payout, like, 19 grand. I'm over 6 million now. Eighth win of the season. And I'm definitely going to get that extra 125 grand. That w that race was fun. That was a fun race. I'm actually happy I won won the race. Oh man! So that means it's one race left before the playoffs too. Got to go to Indianapolis, but I have an, I have a hot seat race I have to do in the Cup Series right now. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. But first, I got to do the hot seat race. If this would, uh, you know, blow back up. Thank you. Jesus. Yep. So, I got 160 grand out of the race. And then here comes the plus. So, I'm basically going to come out of this race with 285 grand, which is nice. All right. Let's see. You deserve that win. No lucky chimes needed when you... Yeah. Thank you, Ryan Reed. Uh, nice win, yep. Alright, Priest. Thank you. That was good. That was some good racing. Alright, hot seat race now. Alright, oh, the 43 car. Get a top 20 finish at Darlington. 200 grand, too. I'm gonna race that later because I'm gonna change the difficulty down the hard. If it would let me go back. Thank you. First off, 4% and then hard. All right, so 43 cars. So Bubba Wallace, get out of this race car. Man, 293 grand to win the race. All right, let me get on the qualifying here at Darlington and see where I'll start. Off turn number four, the complete qualifying here at Darlington Raceway. Let's see what it's going to be. Whoa. Uh, wow, I did not expect 12. And this is hard difficulty with the uh, hot seat race at uh, in the Cup Series. Brad Keselowski gets ball. I didn't think I was going to qualify that well. Had I known I was going to qualify that well, I would have uh, put it back to legend difficulty. I can't back out now. I guess we're going to do it. 
Tonight, the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series returns to Darlington Raceway for the running of the Bojangles Southern 500. This unique egg-shaped oval, also known as the track too tough to tame, has had a long history of tormenting drivers. However, more recently, a new tradition has taken root here. Darlington has become the home of the official NASCAR Throwback Weekend. So join us as we celebrate seven decades of NASCAR and take a fun trip back through time. Let's do some old school racing. All right, time to go racing here at Darlington. Yeah, look at everybody in their throwback Well, it looks like some people are in their throwback schemes, not everybody. Uh, so, all right, let's go racing here at uh, Darlington Raceway. Starting 12th, which I'm surprised with. All right, green flag in the air here at Darlington. Coming off turn number four to complete the first lap, I'm already up to seventh. Um, I mean, you guys have witnessed that when I've done the other hot seat races for the Cup Series, even on hard difficulty, it was pretty difficult. Like, I was having a hard time uh, trying to compete to try to get my uh, goal position, you know what I mean? And this one is just a shocker that I am uh, doing this well. Because I, I mean, I put it down on hard difficulty, but had I known it was going to be still somewhat easy, I guess, for this race, which doesn't make any sense to me, I would have put it up, kept it to legend difficulty. So that's something I did not know about, guys. So be nice in the comments. Um, but yeah. Because um, every other hot seat race I did in the Cup Series was extremely difficult. Extremely difficult. Oh my god. Yeah, like I said, it was extremely difficult. Um, even on hard difficulty. And now I come here and it's like so easy. Did not expect that. That's why I was shocked with 12. I thought somewhere back in the top 25 I was going to qualify at. Well, I have a shot to go and win this race. Get my first Cup Series win. Even though I'm not in full-time Cup Series. That would be something. To get my first win in the Cup Series, even though I'm not here full time yet. Chase Elliott going for the lead on Brad Keselowski. Joey Logano following him. Got Kevin Harvick trying to pass Eric Almarola. Wow, I'm sideways. Oh, I'm still going up the track. Wow. Okay, let's calm down a little bit. Uh, wow, what a lead <laughs> right now. Oh, come on. Hit the gas. Ten laps to go here at Darlington. So I'm up to fifth now, uh, passing Eric Almirola. Now I'm on Brad Keselowski. My goodness, I was... Wow, what a drive up on that outside lane. I'm just... I mean, doesn't look... Oh, my God. Ooh, man. <laughs> was I sideways or what? Holy crap. I wasn't even that sideways in the Xfinity Series race. Well, it doesn't look like I'm going to have a shot to get the win now, but man, I'm still shocked on how I'm performing. Let's see what happens for the rest of this race. Here I go making a pass on Brad Keselowski for the fourth spot, coming to four laps to go. Uh, it looks like once I pass Keselowski, that's all I can get because I'm definitely not going to catch Harvick in time. Look at that straight line speed Keselowski's got, though. Oh, please get off of him. And <laughs> I don't want to get sideways. Uh, can I clear Keselowski? Oh, my God. No. Wow, it was close, though. 
I think I'm going to get him here, though. Yep, here we go. Put the slide job on him. And there we go. Up to fourth. And that's probably all I'm going to get. So, three laps to go this time by here at Darlington Raceway. Final lap here at Darlington Raceway. I have not caught any of these guys. But look at the lap traffic the leaders are in. I mean, Chase Elliott, Joey Legal, now Kevin Harvick's about to get in it. Wow, that is some big, heavy traffic. And it's hard to get around traffic. Yeah, this race is Harvick. Did ha wow, Harvick just passed both Chase L. He just passed all those guys like the like nobody was in front of him. Harvick just pulled off a clutch move to win that race. He just went in the turn three, made it three wide, passed all those, passed both Chase Elliott, Joey Logano, passed all those lap cars, like nobody was in front of him. And Chase Elliott, Joey Logano is. Seeing Harvard fly by, they're like, huh? <laughs> wow, all right. Clutch win by Kevin Harvick there. Uh, but I do finish fourth here, which I'm shocked at. I thought maybe r me running in the top 20 was going to do it for me here. But I was shocked how easy that was. I didn't, had I known it was going to be that easy, I would have put it on uh, Legend Difficulty. But you know, the other hot seat races, even on hard difficulty, was extremely difficult. So, it's like, how was I supposed to know? You know what I mean? So, that was crazy. Um, but, I do get some good money out of this race, too. So, that's awesome. Yep, and I do have an offer with uh, Rich Pay Motorsports. So, that's awesome. Oh, Clem Border, thank you. Oh, yeah, Martin Truex Jr. See, I'm already trying to make friends in the Cup Series. All right, so next race is going to be an Xfinity Series race, and it's going to be at Indianapolis, and this will be, oh, two top five finishes? I can do that. And this is going to be the final race before, before the play. No, actually, no, because I'm thinking that Okay, no, I still have to do Lost Race. See, I get confused between, you know, like the Cup Series, Xfinity Series, and Truck Series with the playoffs and start. So I have two more races before the playoffs. So Indian, Las Vegas. First, I have to get through Indianapolis first. Okay. I want to make sure, you know. Uh, let's put these back, though. Okay. And let's get on into Indianapolis. Uh, go win there. Get my ninth win of the season. So now I need to get two top five finishes. Only get seventy five grand if I do that. And of course, hundred basically hundred seventy grand if I win the race. So let's go racing. Let me get on the qualifying first at Indianapolis and see where I'll start. Coming down to the start finish line to complete qualifying here here at Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Let's see what's going to be twenty third. Ouch. Fifty one twenty two. Not good at all. Need to do better in the race, that's for sure. Uh, Ryan Priest does get the pole in this race. Uh, looks like I'm starting 20. Is anybody going in the back? I'm going to loosen up this car a little bit, by the way. So it looks like somebody's going to the back. Oh, wow. Failed optical scanning on Ryan Sieg. Well, all right. Oh, and Joe Nemechek starting in the back, too. All right, so uh, let's go racing here at Indianapolis. Here we go. Green flag is in the air. Careful, there. Trying to squeeze in to make it three wide there. Seven laps to get a top five finish. Let's see if that happens. It's right on that bottom lane right now. Brandon Jones is up there ahead of me, which is a driver I need to be careful of. Oh, man. Oh, man. Why is Brandon Jones not? Yep, he's going to hit me up. God, I wish he just gets... Yep, I mean, son of a bitch. He did that to himself. That was all his fault. No ca Okay, I was about to say, no caution. That was all on him. You know what? If he just gets over what happened, what, like 10 races ago? He wouldn't have that happen. I, you can't blame me for that one. I was trying to pass him, and he came down. 
Oh my god. That was all on him. So I restart 15th while he restarts in the back. And if he sends me a tweet saying that was the final straw, you know, then he needs to get his ass over it. All right, green flag back in the air. We only got three laps to go now. Which is not a lot of time for me to get into the top five. Oh, I went a little too low. Thank God it wasn't too much. But I did kick up some dirt. <laughs> Oh, my bad. Ty Dillon. All right, I'm in the top 10. I'm trying to get up to 8th. Maybe 7th on Joe ne uh, John Hearn Nemechek. Uh, gosh, it should say Hunter Nemechek up there. But it doesn't. Okay, oh, well, I still feel like I could get a top 5. I'm not sure a win, but top 5 would still be good. Two laps to go. Oh, turn. Uh-oh. John Hurt. Yep, yep, yep. I knew he was going to do that. Oh. Did he... Did he just come up? Jesus. He just came up. Oh, my God. You know, I probably could have maybe been all right hanging in there in the top five. Maybe catch the top four had John Hurt and Nemechek not made that move. But that was all John Hurt. Oh, shit. Nice save. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not going to let anybody pass me. Shit, I don't think I'm going to get a top five now. I just screwed myself on that one. But turn one and two, that was all John Hunter there. Turn three was all on me. All right, well, white flag in the air. Final lap here in Indianapolis. Oh, turn car, please. Nope. I mean, I'm catching the top five. I'm just going to run out of time. Maybe another lap would do it. It's going to be too little too late. Oh, I can't turn. Oh, my God. Yep. Yeah. Oh, going to be short of a top five. Oh, maybe get sixth. Oh, yeah, I'm easily going to get sixth. Damn, another lap. And I would have been right there with Truex. Ah, damn. Just one spot short. It's all right. Got other races to get top fives at. Ryan Priest does get the win. Still not bad. Not bad amount of money for it, too. So, I'm only five points behind Justin Allgaier right now. Oh, man. All right, not a bad race. But I wish I could have gotten that top five finish. I, um, I need to get top... I need to get two straight top five finishes in the next two. Nice top 10. Every point matters. Thanks. Oh, thanks. Ty Majeski, Spencer Boyd, Cascarala, Maury Shepard. Brandon Jones didn't say a word. I was wondering if he was, even though it was his fault. All right, guys. Next race is going to be the... F uh, for the next part, uh, next race is going to be the final, final race before the playoffs in the Xfinity Series. So we'll see what happens there. It's going to be a Las Vegas. I'll see you in part 50.